Hello. Hey, how's it going? Welcome. Welcome. To my set. Your set. Okay. <laughs> Uh, hi, I'm Blanca, and I'm a senior software engineer. And I'm Ben, and I'm a staff software engineer. And, and today, today we're, we're tackling, tackling three myths, myths about, about being senior software, software engineers. engineers. Okay, it's time. It's time. So one common myth about software engineering is that years of experience equals seniority. Um, at least in my experience, that's really not true. I started at Get Your Guide uh, two and a half years ago as a junior engineer, and I recently got promoted to senior. So you? So that hasn't been uh, my experience at all. Yeah, I would say my experience is pretty similar in terms of years of experience not really translating to seniority at all. I joined Get Your Guide pretty much straight out of university. And in around three months, I was promoted from associate just to the kind of software engineer title. I think a big thing there was not waiting for impact or yeah. waiting for projects, but like finding projects and trying to figure out like what is the best thing for you to do. Yeah, I think it's a lot about the attitude. It's kind of like, you know, if you just grab every opportunity that comes along and you really make something off it, then, you know, and it has impact, it will really be recognized. I'll, I'll hand it to Ben. <laughs> uh, this is my one. Yeah, but it, I see I've learned from my mistakes. So another myth is that you only impact a small piece of the code base. I think for me, this has definitely not been true. I get your guide. I've touched, it feels like every part of the code base, like whether you're debugging something, trying to understand something, or you just want to change something. Yeah, I totally agree. I think we have a big like generalist approach to how we do engineering. So if you want to do something, you just go and do it. Um, I've worked on plenty of services that I had no idea what they were doing or how they worked. Uh, but with like documentation and, you know, like fellow engineers help, you, you can really get up to speed. Another myth about senior engineers is that soft skills are not so important, and I couldn't disagree more. I think it's uh, such a big component of everything that we do, like moving projects along, working with other software engineers. You gotta understand the stakeholders, internal and external. You gotta make sure that what you're programming actually makes sense for the business. I think as I grew and get your guide as well, I found soft skills become more and more important the further on you get. Like you're driving a bigger project, you need to understand like why you're doing that thing, like what looks right to the customer, what mm -hmm. looks right to the other engineers. I think a big uh, expectation as well of senior engineers in the company is that you know how to like work with people and that can be engineers, like getting them to collaborate, but also like externals, right? Like I think this is a crazy new feature, let's do it. Uh, you need to have the numbers and the, the skills for that. Nice. Cool. cool. High five. Us or? Bye bye. <laughs> We're just high fiving the audience.